Okay, you guys. We're back with Pisces. How you guys doing? This is our the D at the VIP. Okay. What does that stand for? Make your vibration very important to you. All right. We're about inner prep to inner step on this channel. Okay. Um, welcome to my new um, subscribers. Welcome. Welcome everybody that's new. Welcome everybody that's trying to get a clue. And welcome everybody that just need a piece. Just need to, just got a missing piece. Because when you can take, connect with my channel, it's just, you, 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 you have the components. It's just a missing piece. So we're going to do Pisces. Okay. You see what you in peace about or you in pieces about. That's what I'm about. So you can RP your shit. Okay. All right. So what I do is I help you identify the, the blocks that lock your shocks. And how do you do that? It does. It happens with your thoughts. And for those of you who are new and don't know what chakras are, your chakras. This is your. This is your shocks. These are the. Um, these are the shock callers on the set. They call the shots. Every set has a shock caller, right? But in your body, in this box, your shock callers are your shocks. Okay, and they will get blocked and locked by your thoughts. Okay, all right. This is why you have to create that position of change to create a position of strength. Okay, I'm gonna make it simple. So I help you do that. This is why I'm very consistent. So when I'm talking about something in these energy reads, I'm talking about you. I don't give a shit who you're dealing with. I do not mind people's business. I give you your business so you can handle your business if it makes sense. Okay, all right? Because I keep telling y'all, people will talk shit just to shake your shit so you can shift your own shit. You have to stop looking at people as a personal attack and know what tools. People are losing on this journey and ended up on a gurney because they're still in that 3D shit. See, as soon as somebody get at them about something or or, or uh, um, talk about them or copy them, they, the reaction, it fucks your vibe up. I'm telling you, excuse me, it does. It, you have to make that vibration very fucking important, okay? You have to develop an attitude, I don't give up. What? Say it with me. I don't give up. You can have that. Oh, girl, I just got a brand new car, girl. When you going to get a new car? Girl, congratulations. That's good for you. That's good. You got a new car. You can have that. We all got somebody in our life that calls us, always want to brag, we always want to drop names. Uh, if you did something this week, they did it the week before. If you did it last year, if you went to uh, Italy or Hawaii, oh, girl, they already did that a year ago. If we had a party or something or somebody had a party, just like my uh, my homegirl had a, 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 a 60s party, then the other one called me, oh, girl, yeah, we had a Harlem Nice party too. You know, People will talk shit to shake your shit. You got some real deep, sick individuals out here. And they all, they're all older. And this is what's really, I was naive because I thought when you get older, you learn something to burn something. Folks, and I'm talking about most of them is on YouTube. You got some unhealed sisters out here. The shit is crazy. I mean, literally, you got some unhealed 5150s that's from the mental institution that's not on their medications. Okay, so let's get, to, let's get to this dedication right here. All due to the fact of greed. All due to the fact of to doing magic spells. All due to the fact, and this is all due to the fact, you guys, they don't even know these other people. All due to the fact fighting over a masculine. I mean, literally, peacocking for the cop. Yeah. They talk about his down low when he got babies and he ain't shit, but they want him. Trust and believe that. And that's a fact. All right, let's get started, Pisces. Let's see what you got going on in your energy. So please don't get it confused because you'll lose because Tarot Land tends to come over here and they tend to sit down and learn something, but they're not burning something. That's the problem. They still in ego. They still in winning and grinning and Trying to shake, talk shit to shift shits. And these folks is too, way too old. Quiet your soul. Back off sometimes, Pisces, rather than jumping in this. You didn't jump into something and you didn't back off. I'm going to tell you that right now. Leaving others in peace. Be less critical, if possible, Pisces. Learn acceptance and reminder. Pop your box. Yeah, pop your box. You got to learn who you're dealing with. Yeah, there's something you you should have stayed out of and you didn't. You jumped in it. And you was critical about it. 
And if it's, it's an energy out here, there's something that you think you need to jump in. You need to stay, sit still. Okay, because this is a manipulating tactic. Tack Internalize your values and build a strong system based on one that doesn't depend on the reaction of others. A lot of people do things to get the reaction of others. That's how they get their self-validation. Okay? Learn how to be alone. There's a Pisces out here to do there's a Pisces energy out here that cannot be by itself. You hop from one relationship to the next relationship. One one to the next, one to the next. Silence your thoughts. Your thoughts is getting you caught. You can't have a breakthrough to get through unless you silence your thoughts so you can pop that box. You can't have a breakthrough to get through, friend. You just can't. It's impossible. There's no breakthroughs around this motherfucker until you silence your thoughts. Push yourself a little more on your achievements, Pisces. You have to drop your guard and let someone in. Doubt less, trust more, and try to be less critical. You got critical choice. There's a Pisces that is very critical. And you're very arg arg argumentative. Okay? Cultivate. This stuff, that's the word. Cultivate. Cultivate. That's the key. You need to start cultivating. Like I told you, you have to cultivate to do what? You can't get your divine communication. You can't have a breakthrough and get your inner knowing, okay? Because you got too many, too much inner conflict and conflict. You have to have a breakthrough to get through, my friend. You need to trust your divine communication that you're getting, FYI. Okay, friend? Create that position of change so you can create that position of strength. Inner prep. You have to cultivate. Shit, y'all got years and 20 years of block locked up ass chakras and shit and y'all sitting up here listening to folks talking about manifesting in 10 minutes manifesting in seven days and all that extra shit then y'all focusing on the material part of the of the journey a lot of people's focused on the abundance i get so sick of hearing that shit the abundance your abundance your abundance and you ain't even uh, sh i shook your shit yet to shift your shit then you're sitting there and trying to figure out why, why it's not coming. Because your attention is on the material. Your attention is not on your external, your internal. Okay, Pisces, let's see what you got going on. Something was self-defeating. Something was self-defeating. Let's see what was self-defeating. There was a self-defeating behavior. You did something that's, that you, that you self-defeated. You defeated yourself. Might have been a situation you jumped into. I don't know. Okay, you didn't use your inner power. Let's see what else. Let's get another card. Let's see. Before I tell you about this one. Okay. Okay. So you need self protection. You feel like you need self protection. You didn't do your inner prep to inner step. Okay. You blew something off. Okay, so now this card comes in right here. You didn't use your inner power. You had doubts on your abilities. You didn't look within. Okay, we are all burned with a part purpose. This is what you fail to understand. This is why this inner prep is here. You need some self-directed correcting. I keep telling y'all, you have to create a position of strength. You do with your thoughts. By some thoughts will empower you or dispower you. You guys should know that by now. Okay, whatever your thoughts was that got you caught, which, which was self-defeating, self, uh, self sabotage yourself. Now you feel like you need to protect something because you didn't do no inner prep. Okay, because there's a Virgo, a Capricorn, or a Taurus Pisces is out here blowing you off, and they're very unstable. Either they're blowing you off, or they're unstable, or both. Pop your box. Okay, what you fail to understand, we're all born with, born with a purpose. Realign to align. This is why you need to um, silence your shots to have that breakthrough. You can get through. Just like the past. A lot of people have done stuff in their past, and I'm talking about like murder people. Uh, abuse their children. A lot of people have done that. And they get on these journeys. And they think they don't have to look at that. You have to go back to that. Anything you have done. That you have you have residue. You have to go back to that. You just can't skip that shit. So somebody is blowing some shit off. Somebody's trying to blow something off. That was self defeating. That's what also I'm picking up. Yes. Somebody don't realize everybody has a damn purpose. It's just like prostitutes. It's just like whores and deceivers and liars. How the hell you gonna learn to discern? Somebody gotta play the damn part. That's why you have to keep your mouth off people and judging folks. Okay, self-healing is needed now. Okay, Pisces. 
but you need to be motivated. You know what self-healing is means? Me, means a person need to have the instinct that they need to freaking heal. Okay? I keep telling you guys. And I'm going to repeat it. Okay, Pisces. I'm trying to make this a two-piece. Okay. Self-destructive. Whatever it was was self-destructive. It was some type of self-indulgence. Whether that was uh, messing with somebody, harassing somebody, chasing somebody, third-party somebody, whatever it was, you need some self-healing. It was self-defeating to you. It was You were so indulged in this, it became a self-indulgent, whatever this behavior is, and it became self-defeating. The self-indulgence turned into a self-sabotage, which turned into self-destructive. Now you need some self-healing, Pisces. Insane mental, on your mental. That's why we have unstable out here as well. Spirit was trying to talk to you and tell you, but you didn't silence those thoughts. Okay, you was being manipulative in the situation. You jumped in something you had no business jumping in, Pisces. Yeah, you got some divine deception. That means you went to a tarot reader, a somebody, somebody gave you some advice, or some type of spirit guide you're talking to. You got some divine deception. And this is a crown. It's connected to what? What is your crown connected to? This is your spirit right here. This is your crown. It's in balance. Okay, you should have released this situation. You was directed to release the situation so you can empower yourself and create the position of strength. You was directed to do your inner prep, but you still did the outer prep, which left you in self-destruction, okay, which left you self-defeating because whatever the self-indulgence was, pop your box. You did not pop that box. You blew it off, and now you're unstable. And this is why we got mental and saying because spirit was trying to talk to you, but you didn't listen to spirit. Okay. You listened to this divine deception over here. That's what you did. You was told to release, regroup, and repair this shit. And you was told it was self-destructive. Believe me, you guys. People are warned. People are warned before stuff happens. They know. Okay, somebody, what? Somebody's pretending. You're pretending. You, but while you're pretending, you're descending. Why? Well, see, a lot of people think they're ascending. People are pretending and, and descending. Okay? The wind. There's a change in the wind. I love wind. I love even, last, last night it was windy. I love to hear the wind. There's messages in the wind. It's the wind. You need to change your mind about some Pisces. Something that, that uh, you need to make a new choice. And only you know what that is, my friend. Because if the master is not present, okay, shady characters will take up residence, my friend. Yeah, whatever it is, you in self-conflict about. This is bringing you self-conflict, affecting your life, and it's also bringing you internal conflict. And this internal conflict is uh, uh, knocking your shocks down because if you have uh, somebody's going mentally insane, which means you keep doing the same thing over and over again. That's what mentally insane means. Something you keep doing over and over again. You need to make a new choice about something, my friend. Okay, let's see. Oh, the new choice is you need to commit to oneself. Okay, commit to yourself, my friend. This is the, inter the internal conflict and the self-conflict is resentment and pain. Those are chain links, mental links. Okay, so what didn't happen, you got a lot of mental links. One of your mental links is resentment. One of your mental links is pain. One of your mental links is uh, uh, fear of change, fear of the unknown. Those are mental links. And, be and before you know it, that shit will become a chain. And then what happens, you become mentally insane. Okay? You need to commit to yourself, my friend, because you have self-created demons now. All right, Pisces? And this might be about a Virgo. Pop your box. Yeah, I keep telling you, if the, the master is not present in the house, you are the master. If the master is not present in the house, shade characters will take up residence. They will. Okay? There's a game changer, my friend. You were blinded by something. The Virgo was blinded. Fooled. Okay, you was a rebound break off. Maybe, the Pi maybe Pisces, you went back to somebody or the Virgo went back to somebody. But whatever, whoever, whoever, whatever the situation is, it's about somebody internal conflict, self-conflict is making them crazy because they're thinking about it over and over. And somebody was fooled because you was a, a rebound. 
pop your box. Okay, your thoughts will get you caught. Pop your box. I keep telling y'all, people will talk shit just to shake your shit so you can shift your shit. Nobody shifts your shit. I don't give a fuck what motherfuckers do. I keep telling people, the way you respond, I don't care if somebody's talking about you. If you're on this journey and you are called to wake up, to step up, and you got folks talking about you, you found out folks putting magic on you, I don't give a damn what it is. You have to shut up. And if you do not... You're messing with your own vibration. Heart chakra. Pisces, you may have a problem with a Taurus. You and this Taurus cannot maintain long-term relationships. Or you may be in a relationship with a Taurus. And this may be a long-term relationship. And you called yourself going to somebody else. And this Virgo was a rebound. And the, re the Virgo may be hurt. Because you went back to your long-term relationship. Why does shit sound so fucking familiar? Okay, you rolled, rolled, rolled your boat. You kept going. But you're unstable. You need to realign some shit. You need to realign the line. Okay? You need to realign your shit to line your shit. Okay, Pisces? Y'all need to forgive yourselves. You got to tell nobody you need to work on shit. Ain't no nobody's business. Like I tell people all the time, it's none of my business what you think about me. And that's what you need to tell people. If people think you're a hoe, if people think you're doing, it's none of my business what you think about me. FYI, okay? So, okay, somebody's observing. Somebody observed the situation and did some introspection, but you didn't. You didn't pop that box, okay? And self-observation is needed, okay? Maybe about a Sagittarius, Pisces, what's happening with you? Okay, we got Aquarius out here as well. Okay, so uh, the Sagittarius is observing something. Yeah, so we got a Sagittarius out here just also observing something, watching something. Okay, I don't know if it's you, but this this uh, Sagittarius and this Aquarius is watching something and observing something. Pop your box, and they need to do some in, uh, uh, introspection. Yeah, Pisces. Okay, Gemini. Okay, somebody might be watching a Gemini. This might be about a Gemini male as well. Okay, Pisces, this is it for you. Says get off your ass. It says off the couch. Get off your phone. Get off your desk. Okay, Father helps those that help themselves. So somebody need to get um uh whether it's this uh Sagittarius, Gemini, or Virgo in your read. Somebody need to get off their ass. Get off the couch. Get off the desk and get the fuck off the phone. Okay, that's it for you. Okay, because what? Somebody needs to address their spiritual matters, and their spiritual matters are not being addressed. Okay, you may be cuffing yourself off, too busy to go within. You're filled with every moment of your life with drama and noise. Too much sucking and ducking is going on. Self-evaluation is needed because there is about to be something confidential, and it's about to be explosive that's going to be coming out. Because whatever this confidential information that you didn't find out was so self-destructive to you, Pisces, that you went mentally insane. Because you want to know why? Instead of you evolving evolving, evolving your soul, you, you you involved yourself in something. You wanted to be involved instead of evolve. And that's the problem with people. They want to be involved in some shit instead of shake, shake some shit and evolve some shit. And this is the problem. You have shut down your powers of observation on some level. Something in your life was very painful, unbelievable to hear, and too dark to see. You was too emotionally involved. You let your emotions override the shit. Instead of doing your self-direct correcting and doing some inner prep to inner step, okay? Now you feel like you need some type of self-protection, okay? Because you blew your intuition off. You didn't silence your thoughts. You blew it off. That's what you did. Now this shit is self-destructive, self-defeating, because you didn't address your spiritual matters because you were too big dudes to them. Doing too busy, uh, too too much sucking and ducking in the game. Instead of realigning your shit and lining your shit back up, you shifted your shit and shitted your shit. Okay, and now you need self healing, my friend. You forgot that everybody has a purpose and everybody's important. You need to advocate for yourself, but you're too busy pretending because you're descending. Something blinded you. Now there's a game changer because guess what? You got some divine deception from somewhere, but spirit was trying to talk to your ass. Okay, but you became a state unstable and blew blew off spirit. And got the divine deception. So now spirit telling you to get off your ass, off the couch, off the phone. He helped those to help himself. Because right now, baby, you got self-conflict and internal conflict in the game. Okay? Yes, you do. Because now you need to commit to yourself. Okay? 
and get rid of that resentment and the pain. Because something is confidential and very explosive because you didn't do no self-evaluation. Because you was too busy observing something, okay? All right? You was a rebound or a breakup. The message came in with the wind. You're supposed to regroup, repair, and restore yourself and focus. Okay, changes here. You need to make a new choice because somebody's in a rebound relationship or somebody is a rebound. You need to do some self-observation with your self-introspection, my friend, because these are all self-created uh, demons and they bring in you internal conflict. And this is fitness from the past. Okay, we have Virgo out here. We have Sagittarius out here. We have Aquarius out here, Pisces and Gemini. Pop your box, my friend. Okay, because all this is self-destructive. Silence your thoughts because you didn't got rocked. Like I tell you, if the master is not home, shady characters would take up residence in your house right here. You need to spiritually evolve, and I'm done with you. Okay? I keep telling you, people will talk shit to shake your shit to shift your shit. Remember, your thoughts will shape you, shift you. Okay? Energy. All right? Pop your box, subscribe, you like, analyze the way you move. Pisces, meditate on self-direct correcting, fasting. Okay? Make your flesh submit so you can quit. Handle your business. Okay? And remember, you have to develop that attitude. I don't what? Okay? All right. Let them have that. Talk to you later. This is Alfredo D at the VIP.